Hi, I'm Dr. Robert Laprade of the Stemming Clinic in Vail, Colorado. And today's video presentation will be going through the posterior cruciate ligament. The posterior cruciate ligament is a main restraint to posterior tibial translation at higher flexion angles. And it's also very important for internal rotation at higher flexion angles. The anterolateral bundle is the main component of the PCL, but there's also an important posterior medial bundle which prevents posterior tibial translation. Both of these bundles act together synergistically and in a co-dominant fashion to prevent posterior tibial translation. And it's important to reconstruct both bundles when we do a double bundle PCL reconstruction. In our technique, we're gonna basically be telling a story. We started out by looking at the detailed anatomy of the PCL, and then we went into intricate analysis of the biomechanics. And through this, we looked at the differences between a single bundle and a double bundle PCL reconstruction. And what we found out is that our robotic studies mirrored the clinical studies, and that single bundle reconstructions really do not restore the normal anatomy, don't restore the normal biomechanics. Hopefully, you'll understand why we're having better outcomes with a double bundle PCL reconstruction.